I'm modest because I have a sleeve, but I also want to show a little bit of the midriff. What? What is this? I can't tell if I like it. It's like midi. So cute. Hello my dudes, welcome back. I ordered some stuff from Fashion Nova, I think on Black Friday, maybe even before Black Friday actually. And it literally just came, very slow shipping, took a month. I guess I'll try on everything for you. And I wasn't planning on doing this video, I don't normally shop at Fashion Nova, I just was like, eh, why not, let's check it out. I got three pairs of jeans and a few other things. I just am so confused. I'm currently wearing one pair of the jeans. I will show you, I'm just, I'm confused. <laughs> I ordered size zero in each pair of jeans. I almost went to up to a one when I was ordering because I was like I'm not really sure like the jeans that I buy which I don't really buy jeans anymore but like I would either be a 24 or 25 and so I figured like that's either a zero or a one you never know I almost sized up thank god I didn't but also the they're huge, okay? I'm small, for sure, but I'm not smaller than like a zero. Like, I'm just not. So, let me, can, let me just show you these jeans. Okay, first of all, I'm keeping the tags on. I don't plan on returning them because I know they just do store credit and I'm way too lazy to return things. Like, I'm literally the person that orders like three sizes of pants because I don't know and then I just don't end up returning the ones that don't fit. Maybe I'll put them on my Poshmark. I have a lot of stuff that needs to go up on Poshmark. I might just hire someone to do it. Anyway, that's why the tags are staying on. I'm also gonna put in the photo of the model on the website because, okay, just hear me out. I bought these because look at the back. So cute in theory, right? And like looked so cute on the model. You know, you can't see the bottoms yet. I'll show you in a second. What in the fuck? These are not supposed to be boyfriend jeans. These are not supposed to be baggy. Look at this. What in the fuck is this? What? What is this? Bottoms are like this. These had so much potential if they were actually tight. They're tight-ish on the butt, but also not really. In theory, they're so cute from the back. And then what the fuck is this? Like, I literally, I've never felt like more unattractive in a pair of jeans, especially like from the front. Like, what the fuck is this? In case it wasn't clear, these are a no. I'm gonna try on the next pair. The next pair looks even baggier, but these were supposed to be slouchy fit or, I don't think they were boyfriend, but they looked even bigger. And then the last pair looked like they'll fit me but we'll see. I don't know. These ones are better because the, at least they're supposed to be baggy-ish. I will say they are very baggy and they're not like as tight at the waist as I want them to be, but I feel like I could make these work. I'll probably keep these because I may end up using them for some kind of outfit. The rest of the outfit would have to be really great, like some really great fucking shoes, a top that is basically non-existent so that you can see that I actually have a body, but let me show you. Okay, like not awful. This is the bottom and then the back has rips under the butt, very loose on the butt, like definitely not like a flattering ass pant. <laughs> ass pant? Like not not flattering on the ass. Unless you're a Fashion Nova model, which I happen to know that they fucking Photoshop the shit out of all of their models. Learned that in 2018 when I was modeling for Dolls Kill and the studio over was a Fashion Nova shoot. There were two editors there talking about it. Anyway, <laughs> I wouldn't say these are like flattering pants, but they can work for like a certain type of outfit. So I'll probably keep them. I mean, I'm keeping everything. <laughs> I do have these button things that I got off Amazon. They're like a pin. It's so you can make the waist of your pants, you know, smaller, tighter. I've used them before. I used them when I went on a date recently and that shit popped off like nine times. So I don't know, I guess it doesn't really work that well. Okay, so there's one more pair of jeans and then there's one pair of pants, right? And then I have two dresses and a pair of heels that I'm gonna try on later because I have to go and then I have to come back and get ready for a party that I'm going to tonight. These ones, I'm not sure about. I definitely like them from the back. The thing is my mirror downstairs there's my full length mirror in my room. There's like a bunch of stuff on my floor so I have to stand really close to my mirror right now. I, I just really can't tell so I guess I won't know until I watch this back. I will say when this package arrived my boyfriend was here and he held these up and he was like There's literally like I know you have legs that are the same length as mine but there's no way that these are not going to be dragging on the floor and like you're gonna be stepping on them. And I was like no I mean they're high waisted so you know it's not like they're sitting on my hips and he was like there's literally no way. I will say I thought I would have to wear like wedges with them but honestly they just skim the floor perfectly and they are flares so they're supposed to do that. Let me just show you. You can let me know. <laughs> what do we think? I don't even know if you can see them because I can't see that far away. They're the perfect length. Like I could wear them with heels and I could also just wear them with literally any shoe because you can't see my feet. But I probably would wear them with like a little bit of a heel or like a heel boot or something. But 
wait for it. The back is the cute part. How like early 2000s are these? They're so cute. You know the tag. I love, I love this. It, they, they literally, these remind me of like Lizzie McGuire, That's So Raven, Cheetah Girls, that whole era. I also really like that they're super flared. I don't have any jeans at the moment that are super flared. I wish you could see without me having to be so far away. Cause I can't see if I'm even in like the shot. Focus bitch. Like the lighting takes forever to like catch up. Okay, last pair and then that's it for right now. Okay, ignore the fact that these are brown and I'm wearing a black hoodie that doesn't match, but these are velvet pants and they're also flared. This needs to be tightened for sure. Oh my God, there's a long string. Oh, you can make it a little V, that's cute. Can you see them? <laughs> They're cute and they're really soft and they, they remind me of a pair of velvet leggings that I wore one year in high school, I think. I was a reindeer for some sort of Christmas dance competition and we wore like velvet leggings and like a velvet sports bra and also like a red nose. But it reminds me of that. Back is cute. I actually just took the tag off because I was like, you know what? I mean, I'm gonna keep these. Like, why not? Okay, so those were the pants. Two out of four, not bad. I think two out of four, still not sure. I won't know until I'm editing this, honestly. And then I actually have three dresses and a pair of heels. So I'll be back with those. Okay, it is much later. I think I filmed that last part like a week or so ago, but I'm back. It's the day after Christmas and I don't ever want to take my Christmas tree down. I have three dresses left and I'm wearing one of them. And I haven't looked in the mirror. So again, this video is literally just going to be me trying to see if I like these things. So it's a little olive green, like bodycon dress with like a little strappy strap. I can't tell if I like it from here. It looks like there's a, is that my underwear line? Ignore the tag. I don't know if I'm going to keep but yet I probably will because like I said Fashion Nova returns are like literally pointless unless you're like gonna return everything but I like it I don't know what season this would be good for it's not like a summer color but it would look good if I was tan it's like a fall color winter color but like freezing but it's a good little basic I guess you could put like a cute jacket over it we will find out when I watch this back if I like this or not mm -hmm. Oh my god, I really just fucked up my hair by putting this on and I got lipstick on it, which you'll see in a second But I know that I like this dress because I actually wore it on Christmas Eve Well, okay, first of all, I look like a like a potato like it just looks very beige and nude I just got lipstick. I had on lip liner and lip gloss. So I got that literally right here, which is great Dang it, ignore that but I don't know if you can see how long it is. It's like midi I think it's super cute, super chic. It's got these bell sleeves and it's laced up on the side. And then a little mock neck, little knit action. It's very like not revealing at all, but I wore this on Christmas Eve, like I said, and my boyfriend thought it was sexy. Actually, I only wore it for like literally the drive to our friend's house and then for like five minutes while we were there. They were wearing matching pajamas and then they were immediately like, oh, you guys should be matching too. So they gave us onesies. I like immediately took this off and put on onesies and then later I put on a Christmas sweater. I was wearing like nine different outfits that night. However, I did go into it with a dress. This dress to be exact and I know that I like it so I'm definitely keeping it. And if I had gone home for Christmas or maybe next Thanksgiving, this is something I would like feel comfortable wearing to like a family dinner. Although it is a sweater and you can see my nipples but like I'm sorry you can always see my nipples there's literally nothing I can do about that, okay? You can kind of see the length now. I'm so cute. Okay, I have one dress left. I haven't tried this dress on yet. The idea when I got this was like, this could maybe be my New Year's Eve dress. Possibly, depending. I don't know exactly what I'm going to be doing yet. I haven't decided. But I know I'm going to probably need slash want a dress. So we'll see when I try it on. Also, ow, my chest is bruised. Men, when you go to choke someone, please just squeeze the sides of their neck and do not put... <laughs> I have always been bruised. PSA. Okay, I haven't even stepped back and looked at this yet. I will say, I really like the colors. It's actually black and nude, but for some reason on camera, or maybe just my eyes, it almost looks like it's like brown. Maybe that's just because it's mesh and my skin is showing. I'm not really sure, but this is the moment of truth because I literally can't tell what it looks like when I just look down. It looks very groovy from the top though. Like, hey. Yes, I'm wearing a long sleeve shirt. I'm very respectable, modest. Some would say. But then also like, I love wearing strapless tops, tube tops. I love showing my shoulders. Because shoulders distract men. That's why you're not allowed to wear spaghetti straps when you're like in high school and stuff. It's really serving my Gemini moon and Gemini rising. Like I feel, I feel validated in that. Okay, let's look at it. What do we think? Again, I can't really tell. <laughs> 
I think I could cinch this and make it tighter, or not tighter, like higher, taller, whatever. Harder, better, faster, stronger, as Daft Punk once said. Can you see my fuzzy socks? Don't look at them. Um, okay, so I think that did something for it. I'm trying to get my whole bot. Ow! My tree just hit me in the ass. What do we think? I'm sure I'm gonna watch this back and be like, oh, I should have pulled it up or down. Like, is it hitting my waist on the right spot? I like the pattern, it's very groovy. But is it 22 group? Tw 22? Hello? But is it 2022 groovy? I don't know. I don't know. To the back, I'm modest because I have a sleeve, but I also want to show a little bit of the midriff. But just a little, and just the side. You could probably make it under booby too if you wanted. It's kind of weird. Maybe don't do that. Okay. Do I even have this on properly? Like, I don't, I don't know. Let me know what you think. That's it. Oh, I do have a pair of heels. I guess we can go try those on really quickly. They're just plain. I'll just show them to you, honestly. I literally thought I lost these shoes. I could not find them fucking anywhere. They were like in a really weird spot in my closet. I need to go get closet organizers. I've only lived here for a year. No, I just like am kind of like, now that it's like my second year living here, I'm kind of like feng shuiing, reorganizing. Anyway, this is supposed to be a try-on haul. Mm -hmm. So here's the shoes. They're literally just clear pumps. I think you would consider them. And I got a size, not that it matters, six, which is I think the smallest they have. I hope you enjoyed this try on haul. Hopefully it's not the last video with my tree in the background because yeah, I'm gonna wait at least until New Year's. I mean, there's still presents under it. Like I gave my boyfriend all of his presents, but like I still have presents under it. Yeah, it's gonna be here for a minute, okay? At least a week. So this is a thousand percent not sponsored, obviously. I mean, I think that was probably pretty clear from the beginning. Fun fact, they were gonna sponsor me on Instagram until my Instagram got removed. <laughs> Someone fucking helped me get that shit back, man. Until then, and go follow my new slash backup account. Yeah, I think that's it for this video. Comment below and let me know your thoughts on really anything. I was kind of unsure about most things in this haul, so let me know what you think. Bye!